man himself, <laughs> Chuck Rowe, is here from the San Antonio Zoo. Good, Good afternoon, afternoon, I'm going to ask you, do you la la? Oh, he la-la's uh, you all, la -la. You, well, all Zoo the time. Well, like is, yeah, Zoo La-La is this Thursday, May 10th at San Antonio Zoo. Tickets on sale now, sazoo.org. Now, it's all about food and animals. And, and we have uh, both. We have both here today. Here's one of the animals. Come mm -hmm. on in here, Sarah. We've got <laughs> an animal, a snake, and we also have tacos for food. Which one of you wants to tackle which? All right, ready? Yep. One, one two. two. I'm out of here. Yeah, <laughs> I not, knew it. Not, I know. He doesn't like not, not, an not, animal, a not a snake person. Of snakes. All right. Well, this is Sarah. She's Hi, a part Sarah. of our animal Hi. ambassador team. Tell us about what yeah. we have here. Yes. Yeah, so this is Sumba. He is our Savu Island Python. So he's one of our animal ambassadors on our team. Um, one of our many animals that actually goes out into the community to educate uh, people in San Antonio about these wonderful animals that we have here. Uh, so Sumba is actually native to Indonesia on a small single island called Savu Island. Very small range. Uh, he's got these beautiful scales that, if you can see in the light, are oh, very iridescent. Yeah. They almost makes him a little bit rainbow. Um, so a lot of people think the reptiles are slimy, um, but if you want to feel him, what does he feel like? Like a snake. Like a snake. Very <laughs> smooth. Uh, he's got those very beautiful, smooth <laughs> but scales. Yeah, definitely smooth. Absolutely. <laughs> Um, so snakes are actually very important. He is a non-venomous species, so he's not going to pose any threat to us. But these snakes are very important for controlling uh, rodent populations and other pest species. Um, so these guys actually play a really important uh, role in the ecosystem. How how old is he, and how, is that how big he's going to get? Is he going to get? So Sumba is in his 20s, and so oh, okay. snakes do continuously grow. So he will grow very very slowly, mm -hmm. um, but he will continue to grow through his lifetime. Okay. So he's one of the animals that you'll see at Zoo La La. We've got reptiles, but we also have. Some mammals, oh. and Kara's coming in here with a very interesting mammal. Might look familiar to people in San Antonio, but it's really not. Tell us oh. about that, Sarah. Yes, yeah, so uh, this is Rita. She is a three-banded armadillo. So if you guys are familiar with the nine-banded armadillos in yes. Texas, you'll find yes. those. Um, so a similar species, she's actually found in South America. Um, so she Rita. is one of the very few species that can actually curl up into a perfect ball just like Look this. Look at that. Um, so it's perfect armor. She is completely covered. Even those little ears are tucked in, which is incredible. She does not want to come out. Yeah, she does have a great line of defense, too. Yeah. <laughs> now, Sarah was telling me earlier that this part of her head is very interesting. Explain mm. that. Yes. Um, so all of this, the armor plating, the bony plating. Mm -hmm. is something called uh, plates that form osteoderms. So osteoderms are kind of a combination of bone and keratin, so similar like our fingernails. Um, but it's really interesting because other species have this sort of bony plating, but it's very rare in mammals. Mm -hmm. But you'll see it in other reptiles and even dinosaurs who once had them, like ankylosaurs. Which is a nice segue because coming this summer at San Antonio Zoo, we have a dinosaur exhibit, so you have to come out and see oh that. Oh my God! Yes, so wrong. kind of like an ancient dinosaur here. Nice, nice thread right there. All right. Well, very nice to meet you, Rita. Let's quickly get the information up on the screen because Chuck Zulala is happening this Thursday night, it's and it starts at what time? Seven o'clock, seven to ten. Fifty different food mm -hmm. uh, establishments, restaurants, bars. We have three different entertainment stages, including Matt Caldwell. I think you know him. Yes, Metal country Shop. singer Matt Caldwell. Will <laughs> yeah, be and there. Johnny P mm -hmm. and the Wise Guys going to be doing some some. Uh, swing dancing out there, fun for everybody. And our very own David Elder will be out there emceeing because I got to emcee the event last year and it is so much fun, y'all, because the zoo is open at night, so you get to see all the animals walk around, drink the food, or, you know, dr you know dr dr drink, drink, eat, the, and of course, food. well, you could drink the food, you, you know, at you some could. point. There'll be plenty of beverages out there <laughs> as well. Yeah, yeah, so it's a lot of fun, but go to sazoo.org, get your tickets, we even have VIP tickets. All right.